Last time on Fetch Quest. So we're going on a date then. Yes. Deal. And you have to honor your agreement this time. Uh, oh, but we can't go right away. Uh, I have a recording coming up. I should be done by three, though. Oh, we can just go drink at a bar till three. <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh oh, it's two forty nine. We're we're. There's late. no we're way in hell we're making it back for this date. We're gonna be late for a date. Oh <laughs> hell no! <laughs> we're just, well, like, no we tried. Yeah. So this is eighty nine. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Very yeah. imposing. Uh huh. Very yeah. super villainy. Uh huh. Yeah, yeah exactly. What, what a fucking room to interrogate people in. It's a Who good was room, it? Yeah. yeah. Hey, don't be so hasty. I'm doing a job. This is my job. What the fuck, man? We haven't agreed on a deal. Yeah. That's fine. I, don't need I was expecting this anyway. Oh, good. I just want a good excuse to leave the prison. Yeah, what do you mean? You really want to know? No. Here's what I mean. <laughs> oh, yeah. You can't just impart me with it. Oh, I get it. Oh, shit. Yes. <laughs> oh, <laughs> right in the face. Damn. Uh, oh, Uh. Pewter. Little help. Yeah, Pewter did nothing here. Thanks, uh, Pewter. Bitch. <laughs> You'll make a good hostage for me. Take me to the exit now. Thanks, Pewter. Yeah, Your Pewter reflex did, is Pewter there. Pewter did a great job of helping. In Real. Uh, Pewter supported. absolutely did, was worthless there. <laughs> so we're just in the boss's office. Oh, fast oh, forward. Don. We fast forward to him escaping. Oh, oh, fuck off, Pewter. I don't need your <laughs> bullshit here. You just stood there and were like, oh, man, look at him whoop the shit out yeah, of Dante. Yeah, just like, Kick the desk oh, into him. Oh, darn, he escaped. <laughs> oh, darn, a criminal's on the loose. We fucked up. <laughs> you let him, like, kick me and you let him curb stomp me. Yeah. Like, uh, you were just we're like, all bad at what we're doing. All the weirdness is here. I'm just going to say well, we're much going. All of them are the same answer, which is I mean, yes. the Yakuza. So do you want a to really fucking, nice? Yeah. Do you want to just fucking lie to her? Or do you want to? No, nah, we'll be straight. Let me in. There we go. Let, let, let's go see the drop bears. Yeah, yeah. So where are the Azapiltala Praticolas? I'm glad you're getting all the science terminology. Yeah, I'm glad. Oh, Tessa. This. I'm definitely <laughs> masturbating under my desk. Hand Look check. You have one hand. hand check. Oh, is this guy the Azakilla Protocola? <laughs> what are you talking about? Oh, sorry. Are you the insect trainer? <laughs> Go ahead. Sorry for interrupting. Start the insect show now. <laughs> I'm just going to let this play yeah, out. Yeah, yeah, just let this play out. <laughs> Everybody's realizing she's a dumb idiot. <laughs> Wait a minute. This is a gangster tank. <laughs> that is what I said. <laughs> Took you long enough. Dante, you tricked me. I don't I don't think that's how it worked. I wasn't trying to trick you. I don't you know why the fuck you're me. here at Insect Show. <laughs> <laughs> but I wanted to see the bugs. I really did. Oh shit, yeah. Ross putting on the hat. See, it's time to investigate, gentlemen. Yeah. Oh, so she likes insects as well. The fucking weirdos. Yeah, because okay, we've we established Iba likes insects. Oh, I forgot oh, how good this shit. music was. Yeah. <laughs> All right, MoMA, I held up my end of the deal. It sure did. You won't hear about Renju. Mr. Okura? Okay. Uh, I want to talk to your weirdo guards. Yeah, where are the weirdo guards? That God. I was supposed to make sound like 21 24 <laughs> fucking forgot. There you go. Uh, no, they're not here. Oh, damn. Uh, damn. Yeah. Sofa bullshit. I think it's oh, a shekels? Fucking weird dragon thing. Yeah, yeah. Shekels? Shells. Oh, shells. oh, why did I see shekels? <laughs> yes, we have Israeli currency. Yeah, we, we have a, we're, we're a gang that focuses exclusively on Israeli currency. <laughs> Wait, what did uh, I just see? Oh, desk. Your desk, oh, your so phone, like paper. Can I? Can paper, we hack the computer? computer? Hack the computer. A PC we on top We tried to of hack desk. it last time we were here. Oh, I remember the that. Yeah. There's an ASAP figure hidden in the safe behind There you. sure is. <laughs> uh, yeah. Iris is standing. You're there. a man. Don't apologize. Sincerely. <laughs> <laughs> hey, uh, about Renju. <laughs> yeah. What happened to Mr. Okura? He might be harboring a violent criminal. I heard he escaped the hospital. Hospitals are not places you escape from. You That's can just true, check yeah. out of them. 
Well, he escaped. <laughs> he was supposed to stay there because he was injured, remember? Hospitals, they cannot legally require you to stay there. So did I. I'm here, too, <laughs> in the room. Momo escaped the hospital. <laughs> but I don't know anything more than that. Wait, Momo escaped the hospital? I Momo read that right. Momo knew Renju escaped the hospital. Oh, okay. Yeah. Please tell me. Renju's escape from the hospital was strange. Three things about it stuck out to me. One, the nurse was bad. I laid Two, out the Two, the facts. nurse gave no shits. And three, he was severely injured. <laughs> I laid out the facts as I saw them at the yeah. time. Mizuki was lured to the place where Shoko's body was found by a message sent from Renju's phone. What does that have to do with the hospital? Nothing. I found Iris's body in Okiar Fisheries Cold Storage Warehouse. Okay. Earlier today, Renju fled with a prisoner, escaping a life sentence. An assassin named Number 89. Surely all these events are connected, probably. Hold up, what were you <laughs> saying about Tess's dead body? Oh, uh, well, you know, uh, you know, you know. Dante saw a parallel world with my dead body <laughs> in it. A parallel world? Crikey! Never heard of it? <laughs> I like this guy. Oh, yeah, of course I have. <laughs> I don't know why we have the mob working with us so much, but... It, it, I, I like this guy. He, he's, they like the cut of his chin. Yeah, 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 right. Parallel worlds and all that shit. Oh, yeah. hell yeah, no. you believe, Tessa? I believe it, too. I don't understand it, but I suppose he does. It, good, because I don't feel like explaining it. But why would Mr. Okura do that? I don't know. He could be a hostage or an accomplice. Hmm. Either way, I need to find him. Okay. I see. Okay. Hey, here's my good Australian friend. Yeah. Uh, I haven't introduced this old man, this old fucking man over here yeah, yet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm 24. <laughs> the fuck you are? <laughs> Piece of shit. Moma <laughs> is lying. He's at least 48. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> so I'm not introducing myself. His eyes look like he's high on cocaine <laughs> now. My name is Moma Kumakura. I work for a prestigious advertising agency. <laughs> Didn't she, she already call it out when she got here? Oh, yeah, here? she knows this is gangster shit. You're on the Kumakura gang, right? You're like a mob boss. How do you know that? <laughs> is he stupid? <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> Introduce him. That Moma may not look like it, but he is a huge ASAP fan. Well, I mean, I don't know if I'm a huge fan. <laughs> don't look in my safe. <laughs> Gambling. <laughs> Bad dad, I set <laughs> worries. Oh, that's you. <laughs> yeah, but she's the one. <laughs> yeah, that's how I reacted because yeah. you did a thing. Worries. God, she's just fucking open mouth. Uh, forget Fred, I set. <laughs> now what does she say? <laughs> she's so happy. I set, you bet. <laughs> wow, my catchphrase. Thank you. It's so fucking awkward. <laughs> <laughs> this is kind of embarrassing. For everyone. Yeah, for everyone, particularly the person voicing almost all the characters. <laughs> but sorry, Moma, I don't like gangsters. Wow. <gasps> <laughs> huh? I don't like gangsters either. Gangsters are awful. <laughs> all those Nazi Yakuza guys should drop dead, am I right? <laughs> Well, <laughs> sure, that that was a thing. Yeah, you're a man. Don't apologize. <laughs> you're a man. Don't apologize, Date. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, that's a, an expensive-looking ring you got there. Yeah. I guess it's time for some extortion. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why do you care? Can I have it? What? Hey, can I have the ring? I want to give it to you. Hey, can I have the ring? Absolutely, of course you can. Yeah, take it. Wait, wait, no, I, I, I can't give you this. Okay, you're so cheap. Come on, it's not like you're losing it. It's exactly like I'm losing <laughs> it. <laughs> Aw. <laughs> you guys are a good team. Like siblings. <laughs> sure, okay. Uh, okay. That was, that was a thing you could say, sure. 
Uh, we're 21 and 24. Yeah, where, where are your go? goons? I need to borrow your goons. Yeah, we're, we're, we need some leg manpower. They're out. Looking for Renju. Why are you? So the kind of them here seeing me like this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, good point. Uh, about the Renju tip. You said on the phone that you saw Renju. Yeah, I had all my people looking for him. So tell me where he is. Hmm, I could. Hey, I held up my end. I brought Iris like you asked. Dorothy, come here. What, what are you going to do to me? Come here, closer, closer. Well, it took me to the corner of the room. Come here. Now and then my... he fucking pistol whipped me too. Everyone is goddamn <laughs> fucking pistol whipping me. <laughs> you're, you're bad at dealing with it. <laughs> Dante, I don't quite know how to ask this, but... Zip. <laughs> <laughs> can you ask us if I can shake your hand, please? Oh, that's it. Yeah, sure. Okay. Okay. Well, when I Dude, broke our huddle. for a huddle for like <laughs> 10 seconds. <laughs> Iris, could you do me a favor? A favor? He, uh, <laughs> he wants um, to see your boobs. <laughs> what the fuck, dude? I didn't say that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, sorry. What I meant to say was he wants to shake your hand. <laughs> <laughs> oh, a handshake? Sure. <laughs> I would never show my boobs. <laughs> Okay. Iris took Moma's hand gently and shook it. <laughs> but we couldn't show that on screen because that would require extra animation. Oh, so she took off her boobs and that uh, took out her boobs and that's why. Yep. Oh, it's like her boobs come off. <laughs> Dante, this is the happiest day of my life. It feels good to be the boss. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, so uh how about it? Alright, here it goes. Reggie was seen in two places. First, Sunfish Park at the main cafe. God damn it. Second, at Kume Shrine! Sunfish Pocket and Akume Shrine. They've been to one of those places before. Hey, got it. Thanks. No problem, bro. Really? Okay. Uh, well, I guess I have to apologize now. <laughs> I guess you do have to apologize. It's fine. It's the last thing you did. That's still Actually, manly. you know, I can probably just... walk out the yeah, door? Can I yeah. just... Yeah, where's the door? Okay, there you go, that's the metal door. door. Yeah, that's the entrance. Yeah. It, does it feel like that door is too small for a human to walk through? Well, I oh, mean, it's a partition. You know, okay. Oh, well, yeah. there's the partition. Uh, okay, the partition so, feels like it's too. Whoa! Well, hey, let's have a party. Apparently. No thanks. Okay. What? Why? Because of the words the partition. partition. And that's like half the words of party. <laughs> uh, it's a game of puns, Rob. Rob, it's dumb. <laughs> it, it, it's a game full of dumb puns everywhere. <laughs> restaurants will take forever to fulfill your bottomless drink orders. That's our motto here at this office. It's not our. So Red order Robin. them all up front. <laughs> Red yeah, that's, that's Robin. Red Robin company motto. <laughs> like we'll, we'll give you bottomless fries, but you're gonna fucking wait for them. <laughs> hey, Moma's sitting on the other side of the desk. All right, we've done everything. Let's apologize. Oh, yes, Let's sincere. apologize, sir. Yeah, sorry for bringing you here. It's okay. <laughs> you don't have to be scared, Tessa. We're not thugs, but it's a gang. <laughs> of course. As about as contradictory as meatless beef. Oh, so like Arby's. Yeah, like, like, like Arby's. Yeah, it's all raccoon and particle board. The old boss was really violent. Yeah. You drop down on you <laughs> hey, from the that sky? Guy. He would take a cheese grater to someone's leg if they looked at him funny. But then I took over, we went crystal clean. Crystal meth. Crystal. You make meth? Methamphetamines, <laughs> baby. No, we don't do drugs. We don't deal with that stuff. Then what the fuck do you do here? We had to restructure the whole operation. Cut a lot of people off. Oh, a, had, a, had a company restructuring. Yeah, yeah, like what Mark Zuckerberg is doing. Yeah, yeah. A lot of that, people. Yeah. A lot of people in the river. River, river, fucking. River. A lot of people got cement shoes. A lot of cement game. shoes. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Cut. Their, thro Their throats. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Their throats. <laughs> no, don't like that either. <laughs> Okay. What, that's... Oh, that was a good bit. Yeah, this is good, yeah. All yeah, right. summarize it for me. Uh, anyways. Moma, take care of Iris for me. <laughs> I guess I'm leaving her here. I guess, yeah, she's just part of the crime lord family now. <laughs> now she's just property of the Yakuza. Whoa, whoa! Wait, what? Yeah, ask him about, uh, you know, mob boss things. Like the guy yeah. who shot your mom. Yeah, yeah, ask him about him, yeah. You're leaving me here? It's a date. It's called a date. You'll be safe with him. 
<laughs> Are you serious? Look at that face. He looks like he's coming right under that desk. Not to mention he runs a crime syndicate. It's the safest place for you to be right now. What if he sells me to the highest bidder? Tessa, I would never do that. First of all, I would be the highest bidder. <laughs> and as I told you, we're clean now. We all go home on time. We follow government regulations. Wow, labor's protocol. Yeah, oh, yeah. We, our people unionized. It's great. <laughs> See ya. Wait, what about Shovel Forge? I told you I never promised to play that with you. But you promised a date. And that's what we did. That's absolutely not what we did. <laughs> Dante, is this true? No, date. Oh, date, is this true? You son of a bitch! <laughs> hey, that's what we're doing. You got to be on the date, you, too? Oh, he got out his gun. <laughs> <laughs> that is a hell of a I gun. A gun. <laughs> I started blasting. <laughs> wow. That's a little bit big for a close-range weapon. It's like a musket. <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm just going to ignore that. Uh, goodbye, t goodbye, Tessa. It's fun knowing you. Dante, you're going to look for Mr. Okura, right? I'm just going to ignore this. Take me with you. If you do, I'll tell you about last night. What is that supposed to mean? When she met that mysterious stranger. Her late, late night, night visitor. visitor. I, I do Iba knock it off. Oh, right. <laughs> yeah, you know, same person. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fine. Yay. Don't I don't ignore me. Don't ignore the man with the gun. A clean gang, huh? <laughs> uh, uh, was that the? Oh, he put it away. <laughs> that's just a toy. <laughs> Boy, the lack of animations that these models can and can't do. Well, uh, that's to keep the game reasonably priced because it's, it's not. It's never meant to be a million dollar seller, Rob. It, it, it's meant. Uh, it's meant true. to sell a hundred thousand copies and make their money back. <laughs> oh, just a toy. <laughs> Let's leave them alone for a while and ditch her, Hadate. Nice. We got two places to check. The Sunfish Pocket and the Ukume Shrine. Okay. I want to go to the warehouse, too, where you found my dead body. Something bothering you? No, I'm just curious. Oh, and one more thing. Can we eat somewhere? That was oh, the sound eat? of a... We're going to eat the maid the cafe. Sound. Hey, food sounds good. I haven't eaten in a while. Possibly five days. We also haven't seen Date take a shit this entire game. Date doesn't shit. Yeah, okay. that, that's fair. Yeah, he, he processes all of his food down to the last level. Uh, my chest has getting hard to breathe. So we'll get this man a boomerang. So anyway, uh, we're just going to... Oh, okay. He, just, he sat down. He, <laughs> say, he, he just sat episode. down. That's it. Okay. Have new places to go. We can go, go, oh. we go the, the old woman's diner again. Oh, All nice. Right. Yeah, take it easy, everybody. We're going to go. We got new places to check out. New what are you. I need more vegetable packs. Let's go to the fucking cold Let's storage go to the warehouse. Cold storage place. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's time to go put Iris where she no, belongs. Bro bro broccoli is good. I love broccoli. It's, 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 it's a good food, and I don't know why people would not want to eat broccoli. But then again, yeah, I'm also either. big on vegetables. So like, Vegetables are good for you. I love you. me some carrots, some green beans, Brussels sprouts, asparagus. Broccoli is all good, and I would keep them in cold storage. He's so anyway. cool. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's, uh, yeah. Oh man, maybe I'll just convince them to get me like the a, episode. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> whatever fucking part of that conversation. I think my plan for Nebraska is is I'm just gonna go buy some fucking salad packs and eat that the whole time. That's fair. Yeah, that's fair. Yeah, I saw it. I'm sure. Or again, tell your friend to eat the bark from a tree. <laughs> that's what I would do. Because <laughs> this diet is complicated. Go eat. Go eat. Go eat. Go forge. Yeah, go forage. <laughs> go away with you. Go forge in Nebraska. <laughs> See what you fucking come back with. <laughs> Your corpse, Iris. Right here. But I'm here now. Maybe I'm a ghost. Ooh. Hey, you don't look like a floating sheet. You got legs. <laughs> but maybe they're not legs. Maybe they're my boobs. <laughs> I mean, sure. That's <laughs> 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 I tried to picture Iris's breasts swinging down there like that and then i decided not to i also want to decide not to didn't you say you saved me in your dream is that lightning yeah we're getting the lightning lightning if yeah. power goes out well i guess all these episodes would die 
actually they, they probably would. Would yeah. they auto save? Would they auto save? Uh, Maybe not. Yeah, they'd probably auto save at least a little bit. Yeah. Do you want me to, do you yeah, want me to they, cut yeah, it here and uh, and just in case? It'll probably be fine. It'll probably be fine. It'll probably be fine. Yeah, yeah, pro probably be fine. If, if it to... mysteriously cuts off and you're watching this on the YouTubes, we died. We, we died. We died in Iraq. Yeah. And, it, but somebody uploaded happened. the video for us. And I yeah, yeah, yeah. We're yeah. dead. It, it means Ross redid all the footage and did all the voices, <laughs> including Rob's. From the grave. Yeah. What did you mean by that? I told you that I'm in an, uh, with an organization called Abus, right? You'll totally believe me if I talk to you about all of our sci-fi yeah, future bullshit. We incept people. Yeah, you told me two days ago. Hey, yeah, we find clues in the in the minds of suspects and witnesses. We enter what we call somnium. You might call it like uh, you know, like uh, what's that called when you, when you use like a Ouija board Inception. to summon ghosts and you talk to them? Inception. Yeah, a dream world. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Projected yeah. by their subconscious. That's what we the have entire to watch organization because you haven't about. watched Inception before. You were telling me. Uh, it's true. I got <laughs> the general idea. I mean, that's fair. Yeah, it's, it's a lot of noise and a lot of loudness and a lot of like bomb. The uh, best. How do you even know that? Or how do you even do that? Sci-fi bullshit. We, we have, have a, a sci-fi bullshit machine. <laughs> yeah, we have a machine that we call the sci-fi bullshit machine. Yeah, what is the sci-fi bullshit machine? It's a sync machine. <laughs> <laughs> That's not an explanation. Tell me how the bullshit sci-fi machine works. Uh, well, um, you know, I'd get my buddy to tell you, but I hate him right now. <laughs> I can explain, but it will require a bit of background to understand. Background? Six years ago... Wait, hang on. Where's my ice cutter? Oh, wait, where is the Switch ice cutter? Switchboard. Hey, get out of my house! Hey, what the hell? I'm a poltergeist inside the circuit board. Ooh. What? You said I was a ghost, right? Maybe I'm haunting the warehouse with spooky astral projections. And it doesn't work if Dude, you're right here, though. Ghost detectives coming to switch. What? I'm fucking ready for it. What it's are you great. talking about, Iris? There's yeah. ghost uh, is ghost a, and detective? It's a DS game where you, it's like a puzzle game where you are ghost and you haunt various things. Like you make a crane fall down and uh, yeah. lift up an, a guy who's about to stab somebody. It's just like, yeah, it's, it's a... It, it, it's a fun little puzzle game. It's great, and it's gonna be on Switch, and it's great. I love it. it it's a good game. Everybody should play it. We Wheel should play drum. it on the channel. Hi, I'm Drumamon. That's a pun that only makes sense in Japanese. And I guess not they to just. Americans. I guess they just decided not to translate that pun. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna pretend Thormon, I didn't right? hear that. Yeah. 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 I'm gonna pretend I didn't hear that. Which, which is a thing I know, but that's because. I'm in Weave, so I know what Dormon is. I mean, Dormon is one of the, if not one of the, is it one of the longest running shows in. Well, it's on that, TV. it's Shin Chan, and it's uh, Saze San. Uh, those are the those are the three big things that just air, have aired forever, and also Detective Conan. But that, oh, yeah. Detective Conan's later, and Got also Detective Conan is uh, that's caramel over there looks so good. Yeah, you're right. But if I tried to eat it in one bite, I'd break my jaw. What are you talking about, Date? That's a cardboard box. You you started. Never mind. <laughs> she, she just like me and goes on tangents. No, because right, Case Closed at one point had a plot to it. It doesn't now, but I mean, at one point it had a plot. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? The box made a, cut me think of like a giant robot. <laughs> of what? You know, from kaiju movies. Uh, what? Okay. Sure. Well, I guess nothing interesting going on. Oh, right, the workbench. So my corpse is on here? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> God damn it. Okay. Uh, uh, oh, right, the background. Yeah, do, do you want to tell hey, her about all this? Do you shit? know about nanotechnology? Oh. Nanotech? Yeah. I watch Ghost in the Shell. Technology related to really small things, like really teeny tiny things. And when they make a machine, they're called nano machines. I heard they use them a lot for medical and tech fields. Some of the cutting edge nano machines can even go inside your body and cure illnesses. They can even cure cancer. And they go beep, beep, beep. That's what my mom said. My mom was drunk when she said all this. <laughs> your mom is a grade school teacher. The fuck does she know about goddamn nanotechnology? Yeah. Well, I don't know if it was like beep, beep, or grr, grr. <laughs> 
I don't know. She, again, she was drunk. But anyway, nanotechnology costs tons of money. Only a few people can afford it. My college professor said only the richest of the rich have nanotechnology. But he's a filthy liberal, so... <laughs> <laughs> Great, we learned she's a conservative. <laughs> Largely <laughs> accurate. Nano is a prefix meaning 10 to the negative ninth power. Hey, like, I give a shit. A nanometer is therefore 0.0x number of meters. The sink machine, thank you for not... <laughs> for knowing. Thank you for anticipating I wasn't going to actually read the numbers. The sink machine uses machines approximately 2.16 nanometers long. Viruses are on average 20 to 970 nanometers, so sync nanomachines are far smaller than that. Why are you telling me this? This allows them to access neural circuitry. During a sync, the I nanomachines like are used to write in the sinker's data. I feel like you need to be telling Iris this, not me. She's hoping you'll relay it to her. The hell I will. <laughs> well, there you go. Yeah, what Never do you mind. know about the Wedget systems? I guess not. No, I know what it is. What? Why? It's the core programming behind AI, right? Oh, is that true? Okay. Hey, that's right. What's wrong? Yeah, it runs on ChatGPT. <laughs> what? You're shivering. AI makes me sad. <laughs> it's nothing. Don't worry about it. Oh, my God. Has your mom secretly been replaced with an AI version of your mom? It could be. That's basically how Pokemon ended. <laughs> What? Oh, yeah, that's a, that's a, that's a Pokemon Scarlet and Violet thing, yeah. <laughs> uh, to borrow Pewter's explanation... Your mom was a robot the whole time? Yeah, probably, yeah. Uh, to borrow Pewter's explanation, with the advent of the Wadget system, we can extract the data of the human psyche. This data is sent to the brain, which achieves the sink. That is Pewter. I really see that she needs to... I feel like she, that she should tell that to Iris, not to me. Well, the implication is you'll do your job and tell her things, but Duh. you're not doing it. <laughs> I've heard of it. The BBB. The blood-brain barrier, right? Inside the skull, there's an army of little teeny tiny soldiers that surround the brain. They protect the brain from bad stuff in the blood, right? Sure, sure, sure. But not concussions. That's almost if it, you yeah. If concussions, you get more of them. Oh. The blood-brain barrier describes the architecture of microvessels of the brain. Of course. It's kind of a shield that protects the brain. To get through, an object must be no larger than 0.4 nanometers. No larger. Objects too large to slip through the barrier cannot physically access the brain. Unless you take a saw to their heads, uh. then it'll work just fine. She's just going through her toys. She's fine. Here's how sync works. Sure, sure. Okay, you got the basics down, apparently, but we didn't actually ask anything about the AI Wadget system, so maybe you don't actually know nothing about well, that. Well, she said she knows what AI is, so... I know what AI is, too. I got chat GPTs. That's let fair, me explain yeah. how the piece... How, you let me explain you how <laughs> syncing works. Sinkers like... I don't need a phone. I got a smart eye. That's fair. The sinkers like me equip the sink gear and use it to access the subject's brain arena. Inside the helmet are nano cables. And on the tip of each of these cables is a special nano machine. But the machine can't reach the brain through blood alone. Do you know why? I'm a teacher now. I ask questions. The BBB soldiers say, go away and push them back, right? Well, uh, yeah. 100%. Except a plus. All that gold stupid star. And not how anything actually works. <laughs> uh, but for the sink to work, we have to get the nano machines into the brain itself. How do we do that, you might ask? Drill a hole in the skull? No. But that would have been simpler. <laughs> in Shovel Forge, you can use a pickaxe and. It, no, it has nothing to do with tools. We don't have to open a hole. Skulls already have lots of holes in them. Like in the eyes. One of those holes is the optic canal. Yeah, like the eye, which is a nerve canal located behind the eye. The nano cables of the sink gear go through your eyes and then go to the back of your eye socket, then through the optic canal to the C. And if we fuck up, your eye pops right out. The C? The C of brain cells, anyway. Are we pirates? <laughs> I'm a pirate now. <laughs> that's, that's kind of romantic. <laughs> It's only a chunk of protein. Don't get so emotionally attached. Hey, all right. Here's how the sink wakes. And once the nano cables arrive at their destination, they can begin to uh, sink the sink process. Come on, pop. Come on up. They slide into the brain like roots of a tree. Yeah, and the, on the tip of each cable, the nano machine sends and receives data. This is controlled by the Wadjet system. 
And that's how the sinker and the subject exchange information. Exchange? Think of it this way. The human brain has a max capacity of one psyche. One consciousness. Multiple instances of consciousness inside one brain can cause a total collapse of higher brain functions. Hey, you know how a car only has one steering wheel? I've been in cars with multiple I've steering wheels. I've been in cars with multiple steering wheels, too. I think has driver's head. Yeah, Dante don't know shit. He never been to driver's head. Yeah. He just drives around a fucking Firebird. Yeah, I think it's a self-driving or a Trans -Am. car. I don't think he actually drives it. Yeah, probably not with how I drive it, anyways. That's fair, yeah. If there were two, there would be accidents all over the place. Well, don't some planes have two control sticks? Uh, yeah. Uh, don't, aren't there some games with two controllers? No. <laughs> <laughs> not this one, but other games, yeah. Okay, maybe it wasn't the best metaphor. Your metaphor sucked, Dante. <laughs> and what I'm trying to say is that the human body can only hold one person. If you try to have two people inside one brain, it will break. I see. That explains Split to me. Thank you for explaining James McAvoy's Split to me. Thank yeah, you. What about, uh, what about that becoming John Malkovich or whatever? Is that, what's that one? Being John Malkovich. Being. Like, yeah, and... no, you're not yeah. right. Yeah. Well, that movie also didn't work well, if I remember correctly. I think there were problems there. Yeah, you just control the guy. Or Malkovich was just an empty husk the whole time. And I, I think, think that's that what it was. was. Yeah, I thought, you know, maybe Kaname Date is an empty husk. Like it was weekend at Bernie's, but it was John Malkovich, <laughs> and people could go in his brain. Yeah. <laughs> hey, maybe that's what's going on here. Because yeah. of this, the sinker's data goes inside the subject's brain, and the only thing inside the subject's mind at the time of the sink are the memories, like a house with no one inside. We sinkers break into the house, look for clues, and leave. We're basically sci-fi cops, <laughs> all within six minutes. There's a time limit. Yeah, or else the house will collapse on our heads. The neural circuits would become too deeply entwined with one another. And then we'd become conjoined twins. Ew. To put it simply, the sinker would be trapped inside the subject's house. Okay. Yeah. Sure. Thank you for explaining it. We didn't explain any of the good parts. I don't completely understand how sync works because Oops. you didn't really explain it well, but still. Hey, just don't tell anyone. This is extremely confidential. I definitely won't live stream it. Yeah, I won't. Please don't uh, say this to your massive live stream follow audience, you yeah. know. Yeah, Date, tell me this. Dump, dump, bum, bum. Who did you sync with yesterday? Uh, didn't I show you his picture? Congressman Sosejima. So that's why you know so much about him. I don't think I said anything I knew about him to you. I guess not, yeah. But you never met him, right? I haven't, I swear. Okay. Hey, wasn't that some way we do more summarizing? Yeah. Hey, Date, you saw my corpse here, right? Yeah, and for some reason that guy knew about it, and he was also real fucking weird about yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. He was real weird about it. I did, I'm sure of it. And in So's dream, you saved me from getting killed. Uh, yeah. And then somehow I resurrected? Yeah. Hmm. Date, that means you're... I'm Jesus. It was me. No, no, me no, the whole no, time. No, I'm no, Jesus. No, 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 no. Hell no. Hell no. Date, is the cold too much for Iris? Or is she just having one of those things where when they talk about you, you sneeze? Huh. Yeah, I'm freezing too. You know, people in Japan are kind of weird. Like, you ever notice that when they go outside, they get colds? And it's like, I'm in the rain, now I'm sick. Or, I'm starting to sneeze because it's cold out. Yeah, I've I don't know if I've ever had that. I've been in the rain for a long time and nothing's ever fucking <laughs> happened to me. I've been outside in the cold, I've been outside in the rain, I never start sneezing or they must just getting have sick. Really sick rain. Yeah. Maybe they've got some kind of weird plague version of, it, of acid rain. Yeah, maybe, maybe it's just, yeah, exactly. Uh, anyways, I'm freezing. Let's get out of here. Iris, let's get out of here. Roger that. All right. Well, then, Map yeah, it. let's, uh, where do you want to go? Do you want to take her somewhere nice for dinner? I'm going to the diner. No, we're going to the shit-ass diner. Oh, uh, okay, cool. Yeah, let's, let's go here. L -l -l let's go, and I'm sure he'll probably be here, too. I hope so. Yeah, the, the incel probably.